Welcome back to Sunrise Safari. All month we're working with organizations like the Butterfly Pavilion to feature some really cool creatures and the work that goes on behind the scenes to care for them. Yeah, a lot of work that is. Joining us this morning is Amy Yarger with the Butterfly Pavilion. Good morning, Amy. Good morning. Good morning. It's hey, so good to be here today. We're so happy to have you here. You brought along a very shiny friend for us this morning. <laughs> Lots of glitz and glam. This is our rainbow stag beetle. And I brought him for a very particular reason. So, of course, our Romance is Wild exhibit is going through the end of this month. But uh, my particular interest and what Butterfly Pavilion is really a leader in is pollinator conservation. And okay. so pollinators, including insects like beetles, do a lot for us, including your Valentine's chocolate and wine. We Wait, would not what? have them without okay. our pollinator friends. Say what? what? So pollinators make sure that plants can reproduce. So they move pollen Makes and sense. allow plants to make seeds. So you don't have your chocolate, you don't have your grapes without the services of pollinators. Thanks, Thanks you buddy. don't think. Yeah. Exactly, right? Thanks <laughs> right? for the chocolate. And, and uh, Butterfly Pavilion is a leader in pollinator conservation and we want more people to get involved. And so one of the things that we're offering is a pollinator gardening boot camp. Oh. And it starts the 25th of this month and has classes through the spring into until June t uh, 30th. Well, okay. that's going to come at in handy Pavilion. for anybody that's wanting to garden out there. Yeah. You're looking at me because I'm <laughs> trying to get my green thumb. You know it. No, I, I, I don't have a green thumb either. I got a brown thumb, <laughs> quite literally. <laughs> well, and the great thing about this class is that there are hands on opportunities to really learn how to do it, not just hear about yeah. it. Mm -hmm. So even the person with the brownest thumb <laughs> is going to have a successful <laughs> pollinator habitat haven for these important creatures and make them better for here in Colorado. Colorado and around the world. Amy, I like you. You're too kind to me. Thank you for that. <laughs> so this beetle is full grown, right? Like this is right. normal size. Yes. How long do they live for? About 18 months. Okay. Yeah. So not an incredibly long time, but they, um, you know, they do a lot. They are not only um, plant sort of pollinators, mm -hmm. but they also are detritivores. So making sure that nutrients return to the cycle. Um, so we rely on these animals so much to make sure our world is a better place. And that's what Butterfly Pavilion is all about. That's really what we're learning from y'all this week. It's been incredible. You mentioned the Romance is Wild exhibit. How's our little buddy here fit into all of that? So stag beetles are so interesting when it comes to romance because the males will display and battle for the chance to fight with, really? to, to, to mate with the female. Um, so there's quite a display. I don't recommend that for humans, but uh, <laughs> for these guys, it seems to work. Oh, who knew? Wow. Well, this is such a cool little creature that you brought in. I love that we can, you know, get involved. 18 months, but it has so much important Truly. work, right, in the ecosystem. And that's why it's so great bringing you on so we can understand a little bit more about why they're so important and the classes that people can sign up for folks like us. <laughs> can you tell us a little hint about the creature that you're bringing on tomorrow? So tomorrow, Butterfly Pavilion will be bringing Rosie, the Chilean rose hair tarantula, the big our superstar, jamma. Yeah. pink and fuzzy and glorious. I so will not be all are going to enjoy that. <laughs> I'm excited. I can't wait to meet Rosie. She's it's be great. a deer. You're going to love her. I, I love her. I love her. Superstar. Amy, you're awesome. Thanks for being with us this Thank morning. You. Yeah, thanks so much. All right.